So what, uh, to just facilitate what Aaron was saying about, about the perception of time, this is, this is another aspect to, to linear time in which they always use against you. What's the point of meditating if you can only do it ultimately once a week or, you know, sometimes once or twice a month or, and you can only do it for eight, 10 minutes before this is a, and you just look at this logically, literally, linearly and literally physically. And you look at this and you go, no, they're right. Uh, I, I'll never get good at meditation. And what's the point anyways? I never really have enough time for it. So what's the point if I can only meditate once a week and that's going to be 10, 15 minutes. It's just, you have no idea what that 10 or 15 minutes of silencing the out there world does because it is a death blow to society. It's a death blow to your ego. They can't exist in any form of power over you if you still the chaos of the mind. And that's why you had, you know, the show Get Smart, <clears throat> where it was it was control and chaos. <laughs> and and uh, you have to be able to to go within. You have to be able to to see the have clarity. You be able to be able to see the, the simple commonsensical truth of things, and you can only do that by slowing things down, stilling, calming the mind. And when you do that, the the immediate result is that everything just becomes so simple. It does. You understand things so easily, so simply, where you're just going, and how did I not know that before? Because you just slowed everything down and that's why they don't want you to slow anything down everything is bing 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 that's why they like tv shows 30 minutes and really with commercials it's only 21 or 22 22 minutes and then it's just constantly interrupted constantly interrupted by advertising which is the worst and then it's another show and it's just chaos and it's just chaos, and it's just chaos, and again, and then it's the news, and that's depressing, and and so it's a simple game, but they apply it against you day after day after day after day, and if no one comes along and tells you anything about the simple truth, how are you going to know? How are you going to know? If everything in the world that they teach you and make you believe is that everything is linear and literal, then how can 15 minutes once a week do anything positive? You won't believe that. And if you won't believe it, it won't come to pass. And it's that simple. They lie to you and our worst enemy is linear time. And that's the number one weapon that organized society, which is our ego and our ego use to control us is this perception of time. The moment that you just simply say, there is no time, I am in control, and my reality will be whatever, whatever it needs to be, trusting that there's somebody out there that's got a plan for you and it's a good one, your life will change. Because anything and everything that you need, including the big old money, will resolve itself the moment that you Surrender to God.